architecture is not just made of a big gesture, big building, uh, iconic building. A building could become iconic because it, it will become maybe representative or very interesting for a location, but they should not born iconic. I mean, I don't like when we have people approaching other, we want to have an iconic building in uh, I don't know where. This is kind of a thing, it's quite a stupid question. A building could become iconic, if you can use this, uh, this word in some way. But uh, you, not, you don't design something to be iconic, you design something to be correct, to be good for what it is. Uh, this is w why you design a building. Buildings are for people. Renzo Piano Building Workshop is, uh, is an architectural design firm. Uh, we work uh, globally. It's a firm that was founded uh, by Renzo Piano and uh, we are composed of about 150 people of which there are about 120 architects uh, based in two offices in Paris and in uh, Genoa, Italy. We have a very tactile approach to architecture. Um, I think you know, if we're talking about the exhibition that's, that's behind us, um, certainly what we're trying to to show in this is a little piece of, of what we have in our office um, and how we work, which is with, with models, uh, with drawings, uh, doing things by hand, uh, holding materials in our hand, really thinking about what, what projects are composed of. And so there's a, a relationship between larger scale ideas of, of what a building should be in the city and, uh, and how the building is actually built. And, and these two, two items come together in sort of a uh, a slow and, and cumulative uh, process. We needed some way to present the, the, how the office work, and so we had this idea to invent a, a kind of exhibition that in some way try to bring the people inside of our workshop. Let's make uh, for each table a story from the beginning to the end of the process of the design by using picture, by using references, by using drawing, by using a lot of model. Because the model in our office are still really a very important part of the design. I mean, when you start, you start to design something that is correct. And then if the, at the end the people decide it is beautiful, even better. And then they, sometimes they become iconic. We cannot say that the shard that we didn't become a, 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 an iconic building. Probably the building in Uganda will never be an iconic building, but it is iconic in another way. Because it is an hospital for kids in a country where they were impossible to have hospital. It's for people, it's important. It is a passion. Passion drives you to continue to work. Renzo the other day called me for other things and said, when you will be 95, because don't forget that you will be 95, you will take care of this. Okay, <laughs> maybe I hope to become 95. But uh, so then there is a passion that uh, is like a, a, a nuclear engine. Okay, maybe we are a little bit more tired than the, when I was 40, but uh, <laughs> it's probably the passion, I think. It's, uh, I'd like to go to a therapist to do this job. <laughs> <laughs> That's wonderful. Thank you so much.